So it'd be nice to have some winter gatherings at the plot because we wanted people to come out and enjoy the being outdoors through the winter and we've actually been really lucky because it's, um, it's been quite a mild winter and um, so we've had loads more people I guess than we might have had but we come out all bundled up anyway and we do whatever activity is happening and I've been running the art in the garden, uh, developing a garden work, you know, developing a garden sketchbook workshops uh, which again I just thought like in the winter it's nice to be with nature and like communicating like with each other and with the uh, the object, the subject. So we've just been doing all sorts of experiments and I do some exercises with the group and then we uh, we go off and do our own thing and actually it's week two and everyone's already doing their own thing. Everyone just like wanders off and, and does things uh, and we use all different uh, materials, different media, different paper, different, and it's a good chance for people to A, get together, B, use different materials that they might not be able to afford or that they've never tried. And I think quite a, a few of the people that are coming anyway have been keeping up their sketchbook out with the group, which is really nice because they've, they've discovered a new uh, interest, which is lovely. We have, um, we've been talking uh, with all of the workshops actually, because I do go to some of the other things, um, and everything seems to be developing a little life of its own. Like, I don't know if you know, but the project we've recently put into the constitution, it was always um, a, a growing space for growing things and growing community, and grow, but we've put into the constitution it's for growing people. So growing people's skills and talents and uh, just what, you know, like growing people basically. and growing ideas. So um, what's been happening in loads of the workshops is people start chatting and saying, well, I've, thought that I, I've always thought that I'd quite like to. So like people's ideas have been expanded and it's just like, yeah, let's do that, let's do that. So either like the person's going to do it or like, as a group we're thinking, let's all, let's all get together and do that. So with the art stuff, we're saying we'd quite like to try making our own pigments, making our own um, materials. And um, and it's, like, it's obviously a bit of a longer process than just coming for like, a, a two-hour workshop sort of thing but there's definitely a few of us into making pigments out of earth and ash and, uh, and all sorts of things so that for, for this one for the art workshops I would say yeah I can see loads of things uh, happening from that and I think also just people getting together and doing it on their own with no tutor no which is I work elsewhere in a garden in our a community garden and our, it's not our ethos but it's like we we believe most of us that work there that our uh, duty is to work ourselves out of a job so basically we should be um, giving, like, empowering people to like start the garden or to do the, to learn the skills and to do all of that but then basically it's up to um, hopefully people will be inspired to do it themselves so the people who were there who started it in the first place won't actually need to be doing it anymore so you just like go along in life working yourself out of one job to the next job to the next job and uh, hopefully inspiring people along the way. I have thought of putting the artwork on display um, and the, the things as they are just now, the, this course was about uh, developing a garden sketchbook so most of the stuff is in sketchbooks so it's people, uh, people's own little sketchbooks so I guess we could do prints of like some of the pages but some of it's amazing, I would de definitely love a, um, <laughs> like a, a gallery what do you call it? An exhibition. An exhibition. Um, and I think people would be up for it. I think they would. And we were already, we were talking this morning about, oh yeah, another idea that someone else has that eventually would have an opening and have it. So I would tell you that, keep that one up her sleeves. But uh, yeah, I think it'd be really nice. It'd be a nice way to round off the, the, the workshops. But we've got, we've been doing mosaic workshops as well. <clears throat> and uh, we're definitely having an opening for the mosaic workshop, so it may be that we could incorporate the two. I haven't really thought about it yet, but I, there's some amazing work. Mm -hmm.